hey, in this video, I'm going to use Hosting Horizon to build an MVP as quickly as possible. This MVP is going to be a tool that lets you calculate your budget and kind of see where, if you invest your savings, how much that grows over a, a you know a, a period of time, basically. I think, come on, why we, why do we all get into software engineering or even just interested in this space is to build MVPs. This and what I'm doing right now is the kind of the most exciting thing I love about my industry and what I do for work, being able to just have a simple idea and go and build something and see something really, you know, proper and legit uh, after. So what I build in this video is going to be linked in the description so you can go and check it out. Okay, so as I said, that's the idea. This video is sponsored by Hosting Horizons. Um, so they gladly supporting the channel. So please go go check out the product. There'll be a link in the description for a 10% off as well. They, they give you a 30 day money back guarantee. And I think it's a really great tool after actually using it myself to just build and try out ideas and see if you're, you can actually build a you know a web app quite quickly and actually launch it all in one click, with all in like kind of just one click. Uh, so let's get started. So let's start with the prompt fairly simple so let's start with um a. starting it simple with this prompt we just kind of want to kind of get the basic grounding in there i'm going to add in the isa and everything else which um you can basically an isa is basically a way you can invest money in the uk so let's just start for, let's start with this Okay, so it's taking my prompt there and building something. I will obviously speed this up for you so you don't have to wait for it to crack on. So here you go, you can see it's just using my text prompt to go ahead and start building. What's nice is you can actually see the files they're generating. Uh, I think that's quite cool. And it's kind of a nice thing to know, being able to, you know, you know you can actually take things out of this and put it into production elsewhere if you wanted to. Just noticing the UI here, you can also upload images to this tool and use that to kind of help your prompt and kind of help it build a better thing. So that's something interesting. I do actually have a an idea of a of an image I have in mind to help with the design. So let's see how this does. I think the final point here is they actually have a bunch of integrations. This one is possibly the most exciting one where you could actually build an MVP and kind of get some a proof of concept where you ask for people to, you know, give money and actually pay for something so being able to prove you've got some form of product market fit using this tool is quite cool to have you know you've also got super base being able to set up sign ups log in fit storage and everything else and then also online store being able to sell things uh, this is probably what i'm more, more most interested in um i think that's really cool them actually having that okay so we have something actually working it did struggle a little bit for a second but now we actually have something here um, let's just start with this and I think I might jump to a version I was been working on earlier but you can see how I've just essentially gone from nothing to something fairly quickly um, and I think we can add some expenses here so let's go for I don't know rent and put uh, let's put a thousand pounds hit add and so your final balance which is so cool after is five two let's say someone who's on 30,000 pounds and let's recalculate. That's pretty neat, right? So you've actually got all of your stuff coming out of here already. I think that's pretty cool. So let me show you, um, there's a couple things I wanna show you here. We can actually go and edit this content ourselves really quickly so I can chuck in hello world. Um, I think that's always handy being able to update that yourself. You also do also have access to the code here. So if you are a code monkey like me, you could jump in and start messing with things around, you know, messing things around, but again, probably wouldn't recommend. Um, best to keep to the vibe coding ways here. Um, I think in terms of the next prompt, let's fix the pension contributions. And then I think what I'm gonna do is show you the newer version or the version I was working on earlier. Basically, I got obsessed with this tool yesterday evening and built like this whole tool out, which I wanna show you. I started like this and kind of went on to add some more stuff to it. So let's just go ahead and any um, like prompting and everything else in between. I feel like when ChatGPT first came out, it was kind of quite hard to figure out what to say. Um, I've also found that sometimes like, this just sounds a bit bizarre, but if you threaten to kidnap them, sometimes the prompt performs better. <laughs> 
yeah, I'll leave that one with you. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, looks like it's struggling. Oh, hello. There you go. That's fine. It is doing it. Nice. Okay. Um, let's just do, let's leave it at 7% and then let's do 150 grand. So this is a, a good salary. Cool. Let's look at that. It's all looking good and makes sense. Okay, now I wanna show you my web app that I built like yesterday evening and somewhat got obsessed with and show you how that looks and feels. So let's say I wanted to publish it and share this with you. I could, I could hit publish here. Um, I'm not gonna do that because there's gonna be another one which I'm gonna show you. So let's go into that one now. I'll show you what I built here. So I used ho um, hosting a horizons to do this. So essentially, Let's start a new scenario, um, sorry, start a fresh scenario and show you how it works. So essentially ask for your salary. So let's say this person is on 35,000 pounds. Hit continue, um, savings, let's say I've got 3,000 pounds worth of savings. I have 500 pounds in an ISA. If you don't know what an ISA is, it's basically a way where you can essentially invest in stocks and shares or anything else in between up to twenty thousand pounds per year and all the money you make from those investments is tax-free um, and then let's say i've got five thousand pounds in my pension pot and hit continue that's all set let's go so this is a new scenario we can call this uh current job that makes sense uh hit save changes uh let's say i do have a student loan so you can see it's reduced taking a student loan off my annual in, my you know annual income as well. I can switch to monthly as well. Um, there's a pension contribution. Um, you can see here what kind of happens. So you can say 5%. I'm not sure if that's actually correct. I think that's correct. Anyway, so let's, as you can see, it's pretty cool. You can kind of see what's going on from a month to month perspective. Now let's go in and add rent. Let's say it's gonna be 800. Let's add Amex bill, for example. Let's say you use an Amex throughout the whole month. Let's say that's a thousand pounds. Hit add, and then you can see I've got my monthly savings left here. Now, what I am quite interested in is net worth projections. This is something I kind of always do myself in a really nerdy way. So right now you can see available to investors, uh, investors 431 pounds. Um, you can see my pension pot growing over time as well over the, the 12 months. So let's say um, I'm going to be investing 100, 250 pounds per month. And so you, here you can see over time my the difference in investment and cash savings. Let's say the interest rate, 5% is quite low. Let's say it's going to be 9%. <clears throat> and here you can see over 12 months, you see the projected net worth being 16,000 pounds. I think it'd be cool to see a percentage increase here compared to the last 12 months. Let's add that, I think, in a second. Before I do that, though, I'm going to show you one final thing. You can go to custom and then select the number of years or months ahead. So let's say it's quite fun when doing this to do 20 months. And you can see just by simply investing 250 pounds a month over 20 years, you can amass a total net worth or you know savings and cash up to 210,000 pounds. So it's a really amazing thing. Uh, this compound interest, you know, if I do this to 40 years, it gets even better. Not 140 years. You know, a million quid, which is just sometimes hard to get your head wrapped around so let's i think just save changes um and there's a scenario so now what you can do is start a fresh scenario let's say it's that dream job you wanted uh starting at let's say nothing nothing and nothing and we'll hit let's go you can now see everything is updated with the new value um let's update this to say uh uh, dream drop, dream job. There we go. Hit save changes. Let's say I've got a student loan still. Oh, that's the tough student loan bill. And there's a pension contribution as well. Let's look at the month. So you're looking at a monthly saving of six grand. Obviously, there's no expenses yet. So let's add rent. Let's say rent's going to be one five. And then let's say um, bills is going to be one thousand. 
let's add those bills i get i don't know why but I, i'm not sure if i'm the only one who just really enjoys putting these scenarios together so you can see the monthly savings left and then if we do net worth projections let's say i invest two thousand pounds a month uh, at nine percent like so um 9.1 whatever and then we can do the same custom we'll do 20 years and hit that and here you can see we're nearly there the value there how cool is that and then you can obviously change this percentage and it starts to mess with what's there which is really cool you know if you get 20 percent, wow amazing um anyway so we wanted to implement a percentage increase on this so let's go and do that okay i'm in the project let's go to here and the prompt and say okay there's my prompt let's hit enter and get this underway as i said you can actually access this right now so it'll be linked in the description so if you want to put together some scenarios yourself and see where you could be maybe you don't live in the uk you want to see how much you would pay tax in the uk feel free to give it a go uh linked below i think what's also great let's say you aren't a technical person and you kind of are wanting to use a tool like this they also provide 24 7 support so if you do any, do you actually have any questions uh you can actually kind of talk to someone which is really good Okay, so let's see how it's doing. And there we go, nice, 70% increase over the 12 months. Let's go ahead and update this to, you know, years and do some crazy years. And you can see how I increase the years, the percentage increase goes up massively. So, oh, I just love this tool so much, it's so cool. Uh, I can then finally hit publish and that will now be live in the version that you can access so feel free to have a play and i'd say that's pretty much it that's the tool hosting a horizons a a tool that lets you build web apps um just by basically writing it's a really cool tool would recommend it there you go published successful and um, what i would say is you know if you're sitting on an idea you've been waiting to do um tr why don't you try this tool um, you can use the code below, uh, it's Jacob10 for 10% off. Uh, they'd give a 30 day money back guarantee anyway, so why not give the tool a go um, and have a play? And then obviously you can cancel if you find out you don't need to launch it or for whatever reason. It's a good experience to try all these tools. I think that's really important as well. My kind of final remarks on this is there are so many tools out there now. You know, you've got Lovable, you've got Cursor, you've got so many more other uh, in addition to those. I was quite reluctant to try them to begin with. And as soon as I tried a few, especially like this, I realized how much more I could unlock. If you're like a software engineer or you kind of got a technical background, these tools are a really great way to accelerate your side projects and everything else. And I think it's definitely worth trying. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you, Hosting It for supporting, Hosting a Horizon, sorry, for supporting this channel and sponsoring this video. Thank you again for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please hit the like button. And if you want to see more videos like this, make sure you subscribe. I will see you again on my one of my day in the life videos or potentially another technical video like this, depending on how it is received. Thank you so much.